Hello, family. Thank you for coming over to the house tonight. And just kick off your shoes and relax your feet. Party on down to the SKB. We're kicking. Just kick it. Just kick it. Okay, you don't come to another episode where we're going to be asking the question of... Why are you telling my business? Don't be telling my business. Hmm. Why not? Because a can-can and a can-can, a can-can, a can-can, and a wheel. Now we're off to... Hey, y'all. Welcome back to the channel. And as you can see, he's got that Illuminati shh type thing going on i don't know if he's part of the black boule or the illuminati who knows but hey i know he got some women on his instagram account and they ain't nene i can tell you that he wiped her clean off the face of the earth and her son brent okay so i'm trying to figure out why are you showcasing him nene why did you let peter who you called a bitch one time on real housewives of atlanta why did you let peter set you up Set you up for the big fall. Okay? The big fall. Or are you knowing this? And it's just a game. But before we get started into talking to this into this video, please go to my other channel, okay? And support, 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 support. I need y'all to be over there supporting that other channel, just like y'all support me on this channel. I'm just saying. I am just saying, okay? But just getting back to uh, the realization that um, Nene has gotten herself into such a conundrum, okay? And it's all parts of Peter Thomas. Now, I can give Peter Thomas a little, little, you know, we call it feedback. I ain't mad at him because I'm sure Nene, because she was single, she went over there and asked Peter, do you have any friends do you have any African-American friends? Or just Africans? Do you have them? Because I need one. And of course, he set her up with somebody who was still married. Okay, now what kind of shit? What kind of friend is that? With friends like that, you don't need no enemies. Okay? But we're going to be a little messy tonight. Yes, we're going to be a little messy tonight. Now, can I prove what I'm finna show? somewhat somewhat it's still it's still speculation it's still a little bit of speculation but it's cute it's cute will i have witnessed this uh yeah because <laughs> the pictures would speak for themselves with the women in there now like i said he talking about some shush uh uh shush hey now nah, i'm gonna tell it to the mountaintop i'm gonna be up on the mountaintop with my what you call that thing blow horn Saying it all out. You are a cheater. You are a cheater. You are no good. Nayoni. You are no good sitting up here messing with these women. And uh, taking their money. Allegedly. Okay. But yes. He is single. He is ready to mingle. And he ain't finna let nobody stop him. He like all kinds of the persuasion of a woman. White. Black. Uh, African. Uh, Indonesian. Asian, uh, Mexican, Latino, uh, everybody. But he had to showcase this white woman, okay, first and foremost. And she's dapping or draping the same suit that he's wearing. I find it very interesting. I find it very interesting. Now, Hoppo, Nene Leaks, okay. Big mouth Nene Leaks to say she the rich bitch. She did that in the third. Well, oh, well, oh, well. Is your picture on his Instagram account. Because he sure got her up there. Looking all cute as she want to be. Very professional. I don't know why she ain't got no bra on. But it's just my take. Okay. I think every woman should have a bra on. Until they get home. And then they can let all their body relax. They can walk around the house naked if they wanted to. Okay. But when we're out in public. And we're trying to show and prove. We don't need to see no flat line titties okay we just don't unless they pump and breast up like peaches or grapefruit okay but we still need them to be tailored where we don't really necessarily see them now is this his wife y'all is this his wife she's gorgeous i can tell you that that white woman uh wasn't bad on the eyes either okay he don't be picking no um um women that don't you know look aesthetically pleasing okay because then he ain't no bad looking woman either but i'm like who is this woman who are these women What's going on? Are these your models? Are these your models? 
Okay. Because you're giving me a slow tease of being bisexual. But, you know, allegedly. That's just my opinion. And uh, all these flowers you got going on this apparel uh, that you're making. I, I'm, you know, I don't know about that. I don't know about that. Now, that may be. Maybe I'm old-fashioned. I'm only 54. But I just don't see flowers on men. Especially when they pink and all these other uh, women-type colors. Pastel colors. I, I don't, I'm not feeling it. But maybe I'm not into the design, the art, the creativity of a true dress designer. Okay. But who are these women, Simon? I mean, oops, see there. Who they all running. You know how they say black people all look like. <laughs> now I'm sitting up here calling it Naomi Simon. Okay. Well, maybe because I just did a video. And again, who is these women? I know they got to be African women because they have those attributes. They're beautiful women. They're powerful women. And they know they know what they know. Okay, now, but I'm not understanding. Uh, Simon, no, see, I did it again. Uh, Naomi, what are you doing with these women? Why not Nene not on your platform? She's supposed to be a successful, uh, she, called her star, she called herself an actress. Why she not on your, uh, your, 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 your site, your Instagram site? Now, we know who that is. That's Duchess. That's Duchess from Black Ink. Okay. Why he huddled up with her, I'm not sure. Maybe they were at a party together or maybe they were together. You tell me because that print in his pants looked like he seemed like he kind of hard down there. I'm just saying it's not a kid's show. It's a, a total adult show. But when Nene was looking or feeling on that leg, it, it looked like it was just limp. <laughs> it would look like it was just limp. Go look at my video with her and her travels with her and her so-called man uh, over there in uh, Accra, Africa. And we know who that is. That's Fantasia Barino. Okay, but that may not be her last name. But we're just giving it what I remember. Okay, but that's supposed to be her husband. And she has definitely patroned Naomi's uh, dress shop or uh, apparel line frequently with her husband okay don't be telling me to hush i'm gonna tell all of your mess i mean uh not only i'm gonna tell all your mess now this is the one my family member kathy told me about now kathy i went on that picture i pushed that picture i couldn't find shit on the link to where this lady and her son is at now this is supposed to be simon oh sorry about that naomi wife this is what i'm being told by my family member on youtube does she look prim plush and expensive that woman is wearing that suit. Okay, you hear me? With that hat and them shoes and that purse. I'm loving every bit of it. But them YouTube streets are telling me, Nene, that Naomi, that's his wife. Girl, that is his wife. All right, the streets are hot, boiling, uh, flowing over the pot. The pot in Atlanta is just running over. Because we have found this so-called woman supposed to be uh, Naomi's wife. Okay? And she don't look like she going nowhere. She look like she's very adamant about things. I don't know why Naomi got that purse. Uh, what what he doing with that purse? I do not know. And then I'm like, okay, is this one of his uh wives, other wives? Okay, cause I, I I'm going in between in between. Cause I'm trying to figure it out. Is this his wife? Or it's the other one would look like she was all sunshine and, and, and uh, rainbows and everything. Her. Is that his wife? Because on that particular picture, he said she is the best mom. So, I'm like, okay. Best mom. That ain't his mom. Okay. So, who mom is he talking about? Is that his wife too? Are we looking at two of his wives that's on his Instagram account, Nene? Wife one. And the other one, wife two. I'm looking at that's wife one. Well, who y'all think? Or well, is that wife one? Or is it two? Either way, on that one that we just saw, uh, in a blue Afghan, her, he put under the title. If you go on his uh, Instagram link, you're going to see something that says, uh, the best mom. Okay, now we know that ain't his mom. We know that ain't Peter Thomas' mom. So it must be one of his wives. Okay, I'm just saying. And Nene, you let Peter Thomas, of all people, he was allegedly cheating on Cynthia Bailey and you wanted him to set you up with somebody and speaking of Cynthia Bailey if y'all go on her Instagram account I think it's Instagram it might be Facebook she's into tarot card reading now I'm like what is witch's brew going on with Cynthia Bailey I mean she's endorsing everybody now everybody anybody so um, next time I see her she's gonna be like Miss Cleo but going back to here um uh, it was some comments made under the pictures about who those women were. 
uh, one of them said, is this your wife? You look like, uh, you look like son and mother. No passion at all in this photo. And that was under the one that, uh, was with the lady, uh, in the yellow outfit. Okay, a mustard color outfit with the hat. And again, these are more, like I said, advertisements of people under his uh, Instagram posts and posting stuff. Now, one person I did see, and I hope I included it in here. I'm not really sure if I did. But we found Nene up under there. Uh-huh, I'm being messy. She had put her name up under there and, and had fire emojis. I'm like... Why are you doing that, girl? Why are you doing that? That is straight out of messy veal. And you looking like a, a tore up darn fool from the flow up. From your head, crown of your head, to the top of your, uh, up under your feet. Your whole body is fucked up. Okay, Nene? Because you are fucked up. If you think this man definitely is about you and everything coming about you. He's living that Hollywood life. He's probably taking your money. He's telling you to invest, how to invest your monies. And you're going to be left with no money. <laughs> okay. You see what I'm saying? Because you're making me mad out here, Nene. You're making me mad. Because I ain't never seen nobody that got as much mouth as you. And try to show and prove and do the darn thing. That you letting this eager over here mess you over with yourself and your money. Using your body and your money. He might not even be using your body. Because the, the aesthetics of the optics that you give us on the pictures. He's not into you. He's not into you. He's not into you. Now he might be into Peter. If Peter go that way. I never thought Peter would go that way. But just looking at these flowers uh, on his outfit. Uh, not so much. I don't know. I just really feel men shouldn't be in flowers. It's kind of like. You know unless you're going to Hawaii or somewhere. And everybody's in that. Uh, festive floral arrangement you know what I'm saying with the outfits that's pretty much all I can say with me and wearing flowers because I never got with that it just seemed too feminine to me a man is supposed to be a man and a woman is supposed to be a woman and that's just how I see it okay but again go over to make it make sense that's my other channel I have 30 subscribers now, so we need to push that up a little bit more, okay? We need to push that up a little bit more, and I'll be over there uh, making out, cranking out videos for y'all to get y'all kiki over there. So, <clears throat> don't fret. I ain't over there yet too much, but when I get there, I get the loading up, it's going to be plenty for you to partake of and get your laugh on, okay? At my expense. All right, but again, we're asking Nene, are you single? Are you seeing a therapist? Are you working on your grieving? It's, these are the side effects of part of your grieving period. You sitting over here tracing a married man all over the country. Spending all of your money. And then you're going to come back here. And probably crank out some videos talking about how unfair uh, the industry is treating you. How unfair stopping a black woman making her money. But you don't need to be making no money if you're spending it arbitrarily on a man that definitely is not married to you don't plan on getting married to you that's using you using you up how my mama used to say a long time ago to some of her friends you just letting a man use you up and then gonna put you out to dry and then you're gonna holler uh broke mouth no uh -uh. get yourself together okay and leave this ego alone all right did i say that right Leave this ego alone. Go on with your life. You'll find somebody if it's meant for you to be found. Okay? But this, this joker right here. He just look like he a playboy. He's a Casanova. Yes, he's a true Casanova. Love him, leave him. Okay? And go on to the next victim. Nene, straighten up, fly right. As my mama used to say. Because you right now, you're acting like you're trying to be coupled up with somebody. Think it's going to lead to marriage. But as I heard it through the YouTube streets and the grapevine, no, baby, no. That's not in your future. He is not in your future, okay? He's using you up. We don't seen the type of flavors he like, okay? Because he definitely showcasing his white woman. And he paired the suit up to compare to him. Like he's giving you the female version because I'm understanding on his bespoken type um dress apparel he makes women and design women clothing as well suit and tailor not no floral dresses or anything like that but he's using those floral patterns who make it make sense okay that's my other channel over there so y'all need to go on over there because this ain't making no kind of sense how he can have this woman whether she's a model or not really don't give a shit okay he has several other women 
of color. But he don't have you up there on his platform, Nene. Nowhere to be found. Don't you find that kind of odd? Don't you find that kind of striking, Nene? Is it making you ponder? Making you go, hmm. Because he sure got this woman over there. And he definitely kissing her. I ain't seen not one photo. And I might be wrong. I ain't seen not one photo of that man kissing you. He kissing up on this woman. And I believe that's one of his wives he's had in a previous uh, relationship. Okay. And we know he might be uh, wifed out with the other lady in the yellow outfit with the cool brim on. Okay. Showcasing her style and, and uh, profiling abilities. Now, these are like college students myself. That's what I'm seeing them as. But he might like them young, too. Okay? Probably had one, two, three, any, many, many, mo. Okay? I'm just saying. I am just saying. But he have all these people glossed on and glossed on his Instagram account, his social media account. But he don't have you nowhere to be found. Where you can be found, any Nowhere. Nowhere. Okay? And that's piss poor activity. For you as a human being and you as a wife at one point in time and you as a woman. Why are you letting this ego make a fool out of you? Why? The people want to know. I want to know. I'm curious, honey, because all that mouth and all that confidence you have, I never would have thought you would be taking care of a man because that's what it seems like. And who are these women? Who are these women, Nene? Can you tell me, girl? Can you get down in the comments and tell me who are they? Personally, I don't think you know. <laughs> and he probably ain't giving you no clues, no hint of where and who they are either. Okay? They know who they are. They know who you are. But you have no clue of who they are, what they do for this man. Alright? Make it make sense, people. Please make it make sense. Alright? Even Duchess from Black Ink. She don't scaled up song. Don't know if she have a man or not. Don't seem like she have a man if she's hugging up on your man, you so-called man, Nene. And his pants, his britches in the front looking like they want to jump out and do some business on Mrs. Oh, no, nah, she's not a Mrs. She didn't marry, uh, what was her name? Well, Caesar. I think her name was Caesar in Black Ink. And uh, here we go. I think he designed some clothes or uh, uh, tailored suits for... Um, uh, Fantasia as well. Okay, not really sure, but it's that suit uh, jacket she got on is giving me the tease that he may have outfitted that for her. He probably did that whole outfit for her. Who knows, but we know definitely he did it for her uh, her husband. Okay, like I said, I'm not a big print on flowers on a man, but it just is what it is. And he's telling me to hush my mouth, but I'm like, uh-uh, I can't hush it because Nene need to know. Is that your wife? Is it your current wife that you're supposed to be separated from? We want to know, okay? Is that your wife, Naomi? You need to come on over here to the channel and tell us, okay? Tell us when them flip-flops. You just lower yourself some flip-flops. All right, I don't understand in that woman purse. You look like you got, they don't look like no man purse. They look like a woman purse, a wristlet purse. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe just holding it for her. We got some men that do that. They ain't gay. They just like to hold a woman's purse when she's uh, not feeling well or you know, just some, you know, they, her arms are tired or whatever. They just hold it. Okay. I get it. Got it good. All right. But the fact remains, was that your wife? Was that the wife that you're separated from? Because all the people in Atlanta want to know. Because they are getting on Nene left and right, up and down about her messing with a married man. That's what I'm talking about. Now, is this the woman, my cat and my family member? Tell me. I want to know, girl. And give me the link so I can go over there on her Instagram account and be nosy as hell. Okay? Because you know that's why I am. I'm nosy sometimes, y'all. My curiosity just get peaked. And I got to go satisfy the urge. All right? But, yeah. Like I said, I don't know where Nayona going with this uh, whole thing of his outfit. Okay? To me, it looked, looked like it would have been better worn on her. Now, again, is, the, is could she be the uh, wife? Of the son that he's running around with in his car. Uh, going to get breakfast here and there. Go on his Instagram account. Y'all see what I'm talking about. And the boy don't look like he want to be bothered with no cameras, action, and lights. You know, he don't want to be bothered. He just want to go get himself some grow up, some food, and go to school or do whatever he got to do. But he don't like that camera time. But uh, I don't know what Nyon is trying to do. I guess he's trying to be a model, an entrepreneur, and a womanizer. All in one. I understand. I'm like, Nene, are you that blind? Are you that blind, baby? 
are you that blind? And you could talk about other people and you could see through other people's relationships, especially Kim Zosiac. Because that's all I'm going to be on. I'm going to be comparing you two together. Because ain't nowhere in the world I'm going to let you forget, okay? That you called Peter a bitch when y'all were on Real Housewives of Atlanta. I mean, you tore him down to the ground. And you kind of embarrassed your girlfriend at the time, which was Cynthia Bailey, talking about her husband like that. Even though I don't know why she didn't get on you like white on rice, okay? I uh, I don't understand like Kool Aid with the sugar, cause I would have been on your ass when you talk about my man. We would have hands, okay? We would have hands because on Real Housewives of Atlanta can't nobody sue nobody. Can't you know? You might get a fraction here or two, but you can't sue nobody. All right, cause if that was the case, Cynthia would have sued the hell out of Portia. All right, I'm just saying. I am just saying. But yeah, the question still remains. Naomi, is that your wife? You're publicizing over here, okay? I just want to know. We want to know. The world want to know. Okay. Who is your wife and why are you flossing all of these people on your platform? But yet we have not seen Nene on your Instagram account. All right. I'm just saying. I am just saying. I mean no harm. But I'm just nosy as hell. And since you want to put everything out there. I'm being messy. I'm being messy, messy, messy. <laughs> Hey, <laughs> but that's all I got for this video, guys. Y'all like it, love it, gotta have more. Y'all know I pretty much live in Shitsville, Messyville, Hellville. You know what I'm saying? It just is what it is. <laughs> but I'll see y'all next video, guys. It's the Hollywood life, I tell you. Bye bye.